Well, for people experiencing homelessness, the cold weather brings many challenges. And to help, local shelters are now preparing more beds. Our Vanya Joseph brings us the story. As the day progresses, temperatures outside will drop, creating unfavorable conditions for those experiencing homelessness. Resources like here at the Salvation Army are helping to get people off the streets and in a warm bed for the night. It's cold right now just standing here talking, let alone when it gets night and the moisture comes and the rain comes. Local shelters are increasing their bed count to meet the need for those on the streets. We have 60 beds every night. They're typically full. Um, we'll add 15 more. Salvation Army Major Donald T. Kout says it isn't glamorous, but it's a warm and safe substitution for the brutal conditions overnight. A warm meal tonight, a, a comfortable bed, um, a shower, some clean clothes. Like most shelters, beds are secured on a first come, first serve basis. T. Kout says if anyone is turned away, they are given options for shelter. It's certainly not a battle we fight on our own. Um, we try to be team players. St. Vincent de Paul is another option for those needing to stay warm. President Michael Acaldo says even though they're facing some challenges, they plan to fill over 100 beds. Like the Salvation Army St. Vincent de Paul hopes, they won't have to turn anyone away. Major Donald and myself, we would both tell you real quick that if there was no COVID, we could pretty much make sure anybody that wanted to be off the street would get off the street. And if you do come to the Salvation Army, it is a male only shelter that opens at 4 p.m. You do have to be sober to be admitted for the night at the Salvation Army. Vanya Joseph, Fox 44 News.